Hi, Rimanta Spodranskas here, Forex trader and programmer. I want to announce that the new local trade copper 2.6 is officially released. I understand you may not have time or do not want to watch this video, but to avoid any misunderstandings and asking questions that are already answered on my website, please watch this and uh, learn about the latest changes in the LTC software. Ideally, you should reread the updated instruction manual as well. First of all, I want to thank all of my clients who are using the software and who helped me to improve it. Look for the link below to the page that explains how to upgrade to the new LTC version. Now let's take a look what has changed. Number one, time and indicator filters now also available for personal license owners. To increase the value of my software, I have added all indicator and time filters to the LTC personal license. Make sure you read instruction manual to learn how to use these new options. Number two, synchronization rate is now adjustable in all LTC licenses. Previously, the sync rate option was available for VAP license owners only, but from now on it is available to everyone. Number three, martingale trading mode. Now, local trade copper can increase or decrease the lot size of the next order if previous trade closed and lost. Note that this is a very risky trading style, so be sure you know what you're doing. More about these two new options in the instruction manual. Number four, I fixed the bug in trade pairs and don't trade pairs options. There was a bug in the code and because of this, those two options did not function properly on MetaTrader accounts with currency suffix. Number 5. Advanced Trade Comment Copying I have added new option to the client EA called Copy Exact Trade Comments. By default it is enabled and it means trades will be copied with the exact same trade comment as it appears on the master account. If you disable this option, the client EA will allow you to use the trade comment option, which was upgraded significantly. There are a lot of things you can add to the trade comment on the client side trades, like server trade comment, uh, magic number, ticket number, account number and many more. Please check instructional manual to learn how you can build your own custom trade comments and find the full list of codes you can use. Note that there is a limitation for trade comments implemented by MetaTrader platform. Max trade comment length cannot exceed 31 character and any text longer than that will be cut. Also note that broker can overwrite trade comments. Let me show you a couple of examples how you can benefit by using custom trade comments. In the example number one, let's say we set client EA like in this picture. This would produce the following trade comment on the client side. 1 to 3 in our example is the master account number. Such trade comment is quite useful when you are copying pending orders from multiple master accounts. This trade comment can tell us which master account it came from and once this pending order will be triggered on the client account you will also know if it, if it was pending order before or not. In the example number 2, let's set the client EA like this. This would produce the following trade comment on the client side. Such trade comment is quite useful in reverse trading mode. In our example, the reverse trade would be buy, while in the trade comments it shows that the trade type on the server side is sell. Also, it adds open price from the server side trade, uh, which helps you easily compare it with the open price of the client side trade. I hope you find these improvements useful. If you do not have a local trade copper software yet, it is the best time to start 30 day trial right now. Local trade copper helps forex account managers to copy the trading positions between multiple MetaTrader accounts, so they won't need to repeat the same trade operation on each M24 platform individually. Please like and share if this video was helpful to you and tell me what you think in the comments below. If you have any more questions, visit m24copper.com or contact my support team.